Alright, so when we left off in the last video, John Quincy Adams and Andrew Jackson were going after Florida. Jackson at this point was already in Florida after having acquired it by force. In the end, Spain saw the overwhelming power that the United States had over it. Besides, by this point in time, the only part of Florida Spain owned was the title, so the treaty was made. The two representatives that negotiated this treaty were the United States Undersecretary of State, John Quincy Adams, and the ambassador in Spain, Don Luis de Onís. The treaty gave official control of Florida to the United States. Also, Spain received $5 million, but not for Florida. The money was to pay the legal claims of American citizens against Spain. This is what the United States looked like after the treaty, more or less. And that is its biggest achievement, to establish boundaries between the countries. Another part of the treaty, which is the part that had the biggest impact on the Pacific Northwest, is that Spain released its claim of the Oregon country to the United States. This treaty was a great deal for the United States, but also not a very fair one for Spain.